Tell me if they look dumb. You look dumb. What's up, you guys? It's Tishisha Notebook here, and welcome back to my channel. So today, I am at Petco, and I am going to be doing kind of like visiting different pet stores, and I have my friend with me. So I'm going to try to visit Petco, PetSmart, and a local place in this town that I'm in. We don't have a lot of local pet stores here, but I kind of want to see if they're open and if we can walk in and like film in there or whatever. Um, you guys seem to really like it when I post these kinds of vlogs, so I just wanted to do it. There's a lot of contradictory contradictions on PetSmart and Petco, people who don't want to support them, people who do, and here's my opinion on it. Personally, I think that these big corporations don't take the best care of their animals. I mean, like, they just, it's like this a uh, make money for them. They don't care about how they raise them, they don't care about how they take care of them at all. They give out a lot of false and, and bad information, I feel like, on animals. However, let's be real here, like when my chinchillas need hay and they need it right away, I'm gonna go and pick some up at PetSmart. I do buy a lot of their toys because I do like some of their natural lines, like for example, Oxbow. They came out with a natural line and National Geographics. I love supporting those companies because they work really hard to get safe toys out for chinchillas and other animals. So I personally like to support certain brands. So basically, whether you support PetSmart or Petco or whatever, whatever your beliefs are, I'm just going to be showing you today some of the things they have in there, some animals too, because I think they're really cute, and yeah, so let's just get into it. We're being responsible, <laughs> saving wearing masks. The turtles. By the way, I have my, my cousin's camera, and it's really nice. Like, it's extremely nice. A chinchilla notebook hoodie. Size large in the gray. Yeah, so it's really cute. <laughs> Oh, this is a bird section. So I never actually shop at Petco. It's always at PetSmart. So yeah, I don't really know what's here, but um, here's the bird section. Oh, that's actually cute. Oh, oh, see this stuff has plastic on it, but that's so cute. Wait, is it safe? <laughs> Panda Express. No, it's got paper in there, but that's cute. Huh. Oh. Pineapple house. Oh, is this where you got your stuff? Oh, I have the green version of this and it's bigger. But that's so cute. I wish they had like a large yellow straight. one. I actually bought it from Petco before. I could put my hands through. Oh, here's like a perches, a wooden perch. It doesn't tell you what kind of wood they're made from. Like, I'm sure they're safe, but I don't know for sure, so. Oh, here are the water bottles. You don't want plastic. No, you can use plastic. It just <laughs> it goes bad faster. I mean, like you have to clean it more often. They break. You have this, right? I used to. I used to have KT. Now I have like all living things. Oh look! No look. Is that the one I would get? Syrian? No, these are teddy bear hamsters. So cute. Which one did I get? I'm gonna go find it. I don't know. That. They have like oat hay. I've been wanting to try, and it's like oxbow, that's why I like it. But I've been wanting to try like a different, like alfalfa hay. Like a different kind, because I always just use Timothy hay, but you know, like as a treat though. <laughs> okay, so which which uh, hamster would I get? Okay, so this is a chinchilla care sheet, like facts. Up to 10 years, I mean, they tell you that. You guys can see that. A well socialized chinchilla likes to be cuddled and carried. That's no, definitely not true. Most don't like that, but anyway. I mean, they've got a lot of things right in here. I feel like they've gotten a lot better since I first bought my chinchilla like seven years ago. Wait, 2012? That was eight years ago. Oh, that's Oxbow's my favorite. Oh! Wait, you guys, I've never actually seen this before. Garden Select Chinchilla Food. I've actually never seen that. I wonder if it's... I'm going to do my research into this. This is actually kind of cool. I've never seen it. I am recommended by veterinaries. Um, I always just get the typical like red bag. I, ne I never get like the garden selects. So it's kind of cool. But it looks good. I mean, I really trust the Oxbow brand. And they even tell you how to transition to new foods. That's kind of cool. 70% grassy, that's what you want. 8% greens. Oh, that's really nice. I actually might want to try this. Oh, and I actually bought this recently from Chewy.com, and you'll be seeing it in a future haul video. But yeah, I bought these. It's from the Oxbow and Rich Life kind of brand. But yeah, they really stepped up their packaging. <laughs> yeah.
So this is the PetSmart that we have here. This is actually relatively new, I think only a year. So this is a very small town. Not a lot of things happen in here. Ask up, oh. kids, it's the wall. It is what it is. I really want a pet snake alley. I still want one. What, what? Pet snake. Oh, these are the bird toys. These are the bird toys. I usually actually always buy toys from here. And I really wanted to get the big one, but I have a feeling Merlin would just chew the sharp edges away and then like let the rest go to waste. So that's why I try to go for like smaller pieces. Oh, this is so, this is what they would love. Is it safe for them or no? Yeah, it is. This material is safe. Is this? Not this stuff. No, is this safe? No, I don't think this is safe. The metal is, probably. I don't know. Everything that I, like, when I look at a toy, everything in here is relatively safe, I feel like. When I look at a toy, I just think of, like, materials that I've seen before that are safe. Some things I don't know, so I just stay away from it. That's actually kind of cute. So this is the small pet section here that they have. And again, Oxbow with their like enriched life line. That's so cute. I feel like my chinchillas would just love that. We used to have one of those huge balls for our chinchilla, our old chinchilla, a long time ago. So yeah, this is just a selection. I kind of like that they have like these little wooden stuff and Lufa toys because it's so cute for like pictures or whatever. If you wanted to take some with your chinchilla, Himalayan salt. By the way, chinchillas don't need extra minerals or salt. They raised the price. This used to be $6.99. Inflation. This is so cute. So, yep. That's what they have. Apps. Here's their stuff again. Oh, yeah. Garden Select. The prices are the same as Petco. Oh, so, here's like the Orchard Grass Hay. Hay blends. It's like Orchard Grass and Timothy. I mean, this is what I feed my chinchillas. You're supposed to feed just Timothy. Hay is a main diet, but like, I don't know. These ones are kind of nice for like a treat sometimes. Alfalfa hay. It's a little sweeter, so that's why. But yeah, see, sweet. They even tell you. That's so cool. So they even tell you how much sweetness is in there. And this one is like two on the sweet scale. Oh, and this one's so three on the sweet scale. So yeah, I think we're just gonna go to another pet store now and see what they have and it's like a local one so it's not like pet smart or pet co okay so we are at the pet store that's local and i'm not going to share the name for obvious reasons of course making sure you're wearing your mask thankfully i have a good attitude about it yeah, of course. <laughs> Why, wipe your nose. <laughs> That's what my dad always said. <laughs> okay, you want the camera? No. Yes, you do. Oh, okay, sure. Fine, I'll take it. <laughs> She's a little shy. I am a lot shy. Wait, why is it zoomed in so much? Okay. Um, it's a rabbit. No, now They're I want so one. Good. We have like this. Wait, so is this the? Is this the? We have a rabbit in, in our this, yard. Is this a hamster I've kept? I don't know. The one in there, its face is squished. Wait, that's so cute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mice back there. Ew, so ugly. Awesome. You're being racist. Their tails, especially. Look how cute. Look how active they all are. They're just like. They're so cute. Mm -hmm. I wonder where they have supplies for like small pets because these, oh, they're, I see them. So these are like, no, these are for the birds. This is cute. I don't even think coconut's safe for them, but it looks so cute. Wacky wood. Oh, okay. Oh, these are cute. Oh, this is what we bought to feed the, the neighbor's huskies when they were born. Oh, and they thought the one was going to die, but it didn't. Hip and joint for cats. Quiet moments. Calming aid. Hairball relief. Literally, there's everything. That's so cute. Oh, it's like the same brands that Pet Smart and Petco have. Nothing new. This is cute. Oh, how are you guys doing today? We're doing good. And now we're just looking. And then these. These are actually super cool. I've never seen these before.
before I get so we're gonna go now <laughs> and yeah so that was just our experience with these pet stores and like visiting them so I hope it was kind of entertaining but anyway mask up <laughs>